noticing some problems, uh, for example, the nursery rhymes or some auditory memory problems, um, would an assessment be the first port of call, do you think? Well, in a preschool child, um, probably it would be very wise to see a speech and language therapist um, because they might just have a developmental delay. And, and that's where you, you trained as a speech I am a speech and language, language, yes, therapist. Um, but many children are highly articulate before they go to school and the parents are full of confidence that they are not going to have any problems, even if there's dyslexia in the family. And they're the sort of children who may actually um, fail to learn to read uh, easily if they've got a visual memory problem because they don't recognise words that they've seen many times. Mm. So children who are late to, to speak or um, have trouble using language before they go to school are in the at-risk category but it doesn't necessarily mean they're going to be dyslexic. But you still think seeing a speech and language therapist would be good? That would good. be good, yes, because most educational psychologists prefer not to see children to diagnose dyslexia before they're around seven. But there again, it can be very worrying when you've got a five or six year old at school. Um, so if it's very obvious, even when they're five or six, it's quite good to um, go and have a preliminary assessment with a, an educational psychologist.